Hey guys, I live in Singapore. It's pretty hot outside, so air conditioning is pretty important to keep a working temperature to get stuff done and be productive. Now, outside, the, the aircon service guys are servicing my, my air conditioning units. I have about five of them and, um, and typically they just seem to take the cover off and wash it and that's about it. And sometimes they try to charge me extra for gas or cleaning the unit outside. Now, the thing that came up on my radar was this excellent video by DHH, the guy behind Rails. Long story short, he talks about his like dream home and how he had problems with it, you know, his daughter going blind because of that like new house smell and all that sort of stuff, the formaldehyde. And the fact that it was energy efficient meant that there was no fresh air coming in. Anywho, so since then I've been, since I work in a small room for hours in a day, I was a bit getting a bit obsessed about CO2 levels myself. Hence, I bought this bad boy, um, which I saw in some sort of Tesla Elon Musk tweet. Um, the platform itself is quite interesting. You can see the components here. So this is the temperature and humidity. <clears throat> this is the CO2 sensor here. And uh, I've only got this a couple of days ago, but it seems like it's working. You know, if you breathe on it, the CO2 goes up. And uh, yeah, and interestingly, it gets up to something like 2000 quite easily overnight when I'm sleeping in my bedroom over there. So yeah, I'm a little bit, um, and here's a, I mean, this is like, not cheap. This is like a hundred dollars and this is like $10 Xiaomi. I was kind of hoping to be able to plug in the USB and be able to get the values off, but it doesn't seem to work. And I still don't actually know what these function buttons do. And similarly, I got the Xiaomi because I was kind of hoping that I could work out how to get the Bluetooth values out. I haven't yet. So, but it, this is 10 bucks. This is a hundred bucks. The CO2 sensor from a company called senseair.com, a Swedish company. Yeah, so now I'm measuring my CO2 levels. I asked the aircon guys just then, how do I get fresh air? Because right now all these aircons are doing, I mean, to my surprise, I didn't even know this um, before, before uh, watching this video. How do I get fresh air in here? And they were telling me you can't with this system. Oh dear. But newer condos have adducted systems which is pretty much the norm in commercial buildings not so much in residential and these ducted buildings do bring in fresh air and make the air quality better so there you have it i'm just sharing all i know about air quality to, to you guys if you know better any practical tips to improve things especially for people like me living in singapore who need their air conditioned do please do please let me know in the comments below as ever, thank you for watching. Please like the video and all that jazz. And why not subscribe? Why not? Bye.